In this section, we talk about tools that students can use for both gaming and studying. Gaming is a hobby for everyone, even for students. Directly, game developers and school institutions such as universities have quite little in common. As community members of both gaming communities and study communities, students may be able to use similar tools for gaming and study. These tools will be here categorized into peripherals and software. It is possible to study gaming and habits of your opponents with different analytics tools, but our way of studying refers to more traditional studies. Especially PC gamers have specific equipment they use to play their games. A wireless mouse and a mechanical 10 keyless keyboard are tools that work well in study-related matters. They are simply more convenient to use. Gaming monitors with higher refresh rates ensure that your eyes are not easily fatigued. Gaming laptops are also increasing in popularity, and if the laptop has power to run modern games, then it most likely has the power to run study-related software. In-game analysis tools are more common nowadays than they were a few years ago. Still, there is a chance that someone uses Microsoft Excel to track and analyze the data from in-game. Excel has become slightly less used as some games such as League of Legends offer an analysis tool within the game client. For some item builds and other type of data tracking, Excel can still be very valuable. According to our students, there are some Excel users for card games, such as Hearthstone. Also, Excel spreadsheets are used in World of Warcraft for anything you can imagine. For example, searching specific gear combinations. Microsoft Excel is a commonly used tool in studying and can be used in various cases. For example, tracking hours used for study-related projects or for accounting. Communication is important in competitive video games, as well as in studying, as you have to work as a team for a common goal. It is possible to communicate by writing or by speaking. Discord can be regarded as a platform for different communities, and at least in our case, in our university, there is a unified community for both gaming and studying. Via Discord, students can communicate in written form or by joining a voice channel for discussion. Even if Discord is not an official tool for communication in a school environment, it has worked well alongside with all the official channels, such as email and Teams. It can be used for information sharing and announcements by students and teachers. A website for learning firsthand how to in any subject. YouTube. YouTube is said to be the greatest teacher in the world. And naturally, this applies to learning concepts of business, building things yourself, and using tutorials to make you a better player in the game of your choosing. It is not used only by students and gamers, but students and gamers also can get a lot of information to help them understand study and game-related matters.